today with Jack Carr in the house. This time, you already know we got the ballistic uh, zombie, zombie heads. heads. Zombie heads. So you brought your bow out. I did. And I want you to talk about this a little bit because one of the things I love about your books yep. is how detailed you are about their loadout, the type of gear they're using and everything. So what do you got? What'd you bring us? Yeah, yeah, so you guys said throw some bows in the vehicle. So I threw four bows in, so throw some tomahawks in there. So I threw about a hundred tomahawks in there. Uh, but yeah, this is a PSC NTN 33 that John Dudley put together for me. Uh, it has a Sitka pattern cab all there. Nice. It's my dear friend, John Hart, uh, who I went to, to high school with, grew up with, uh, started Sitka. So you guys started it. So got that on there. And this thing is legit. Yeah. Got spot hog on it. <laughs> it's like this thing's ready to go. Here's the NTN 33. You got the, uh, the, uh, the knock on symbol right there. Sweet. Here we go. NTN EFO. ESFO. So, yeah, pretty sweet right here. So, we're going to uh, test this thing out yeah. on some zombies. That's right? it. Yeah. And so, in keeping with the theme of surprises, uh, I got one more additional thing that we'll do maybe after the zombie hits. So, Let's get right. to it. Come on, let's go. Let's do it. Bam! Yeah. Right above the jaw there. So I, I was a little indifferent. Like I wasn't sure, you know, like the the zombie looking one or the clear one, but I, I really feel like we should just go straight to the, the clear one because I want to see right. I, I want to see the arrow passing through yeah. like the little pieces of skull and stuff because I feel like you you got the, the spine there on him. I got him, yeah, I hurt him really bad. <laughs> yeah. You no, know, for me, like I like the slow-mo fragmentation and everything else, and it's just like you know, this is cool, but yeah, let's go to the skull. Let's not, get some green zombie yeah. blood exploding. Yeah let's, yeah, let's get the clear one out, and yeah. then I got something, something fun for you afterwards. Awesome. Okay. Okay. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. <laughs> All right. higher on that guy. I wanted to make sure we got into the cranium there and got some of that zombie blood coming out so we could prove that it actually was a zombie. Yeah, he's so leaking. He's leaking green blood. Went right through 
pass through all the way. <laughs> yeah, that was, uh, I don't think you could have hit that any better on that, that one. That's pretty good. I kind of want to do this again. I'd like to see like the, the, the temple eye. or the jaw or yeah. something. That way, and slow well, exit wound. Show that exit wound. Turn oh, jeez, yeah. Oh, that's epic. Get the little zombie brain in there. Oh, it's still hanging out. That's wild. That's awesome. I dig it. Let's do it again. And then I'm going to set something special up for you. Do it. Do it. Okay, went right into the temple, passed all the way through. So this time I'll try to go, I don't know, here, maybe the eye, top of the jaw, somewhere here, but yeah, that was right. Yeah, so I think what's happening, because it is ballistic gel, it's got a wound channel, an existing one, and it just wants to go to the path of least resistance. Yeah, because it, clearly way, way from the entrance point over there, but they, they try to go off. I'll try to go over here. Okay. okay. Like. Yeah, go go into the jaw or something there. Yeah, see his little mouth. Cool. Move around. Let's do it. jaw on that one so we did yeah that was like <laughs> right in there Dude, that's great that is crazy so the first one uh you know you had perfect Shh. right in the the side of the head right and the good. second one was a little bit closer to the temple yeah and i know you were trying to get there but it's like the the arrow deviated yeah. into the previous wound channel yeah. and the exit wounds like pretty same. much in the same spot yeah. uh and then the we jaw, the jaw. That's Dang. great. Yeah. Crazy. Yeah. It's, so it's not fun. a kill shot, but he would be hurting. You can, he needed some dental work. You can see the fletching like right behind the teeth there. <laughs> That's crazy. That's awesome. That's nice. Great. That's great. So you asked if there were going to be explosions. Uh, fortunately, we're in the Black Rifle Coffee parking lot, so I can't really do a whole lot of explosions, but I will set something up for you real quick. It's a fun little archery fireball. I like it. Let's like do it. it. Let's yes. do it. Let's do it. Hey, we're going to have an open flame here. Okay. <laughs> when you hit this, it's going to go up. Nice. You're going to have some flammable gases here. You don't have to worry about a blowback or frag or anything like that because uh, the contents are under pressure, but it's not going to explode, right? That's yeah. Okay. So, so why do we have three? Generally, the, the colors will blend together. That's honestly the cool part, right? We see like the gases igniting a few feet away. But, uh, wow. Yeah. I just need to hit it. Well, yeah, that, 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 yeah, I got faith in you. I mean, if you're able to hit the jaw on the man, uh, can I? Let's do it. I got faith Long in you. Pressure. You get anywhere in here or anything like that, like okay. anywhere in the body, the gas is going to come out of the sauce. It's too easy. <laughs>
Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, we, I know we had to dump footage really quick, but <laughs> it's in uh, there. I'm usually against the destruction of books, but this is I a want it. copy, which means that it's a, uh, a rough draft. Oh, gotcha. So this is uh, definitely not something that I would normally do, but we have explosions. <laughs> we have a rough draft. It's called the devil's hand. Uh, Dudley, I'm sorry about the arrow. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I have to order a couple more, I think. Yeah, so, That's, okay. Uh, we get to use tomahawks. A little bit of fireballs. Not not quite the explosion, but, Dude. you know, maybe That's maybe we'll legit. do some exploding arrows down the road. <laughs> I'll let the really wind little warm. pick the fire up there a little bit. <laughs> That's crazy. That was a great day. Thank you so much. Yeah, no, I appreciate That's you awesome, coming brother. out. Tell so everyone what you got going on. Because so, yep, yep, a lot going on. Got the book coming book? out April 13th, The Devil's Hand. Have uh, filming for the Amazon series, the Terminal List, starring Chris Pratt, starting here soon. Officialjackcar.com and Jack Car USA on the Listen, socials. If you guys are gearheads, you got to check out his Instagram because in the books, he breaks down like to the detail some of these kits and loadouts just so well so well and like how you lay that out on your instagram and everything i don't know i just i appreciate it no thank you so much it's great everything you wear like as far as uh weapons and blades and and flashlights belts boots all that tells a story yeah well because so I, I use that so character development we did a vets react you guys got to check out um i'll put links to all this stuff in the description below but you know back in the day you had rambo right you had the bowie knife and everything else it was like it was very generic and like for you to go into very brand specific go deep, go deep. it's like yep. it's awesome anyways i'm rambling on here officialjackcar.com check right. out the devil's hand new book coming out here soon yep and uh you got a new show coming on Amazon yep. starring Chris yep. Pratt.
It's crazy. So, exciting. crazy. so much stuff. All right, we appreciate you guys watching. Thank you so much. I've got nothing else for you. Let this book finish up here. <laughs> I can't even. It's got a fire extinguisher. <laughs> Let's go. Bam!